So I think that this is a really big step towards the Amazon FBA model. Okay, so eBay just released a gigantic update that most sellers don't know about yet. So yesterday eBay released a really cool new update to their future business plans. And I think it's a really interesting move and might really benefit a lot of different sellers. So let's talk about it. So it seems like eBay has been really busy behind the scenes making a ton of updates. Just a few weeks ago, we had some really major updates, but now this is a really cool long-term thing to look for. What we're going to talk about in this video is kind of the precursor to, I think, think eBay going down the Amazon FBA sort of model in the future. So yesterday eBay said that they're creating the eBay vault, which is pretty much going to be like a safe storage area for people that sell collectibles. Say you sell nice trading cards. You don't necessarily want to really be in charge of them for whatever reason. Maybe you don't have a place to store them. Maybe you live in like a frat house and people are always going through your stuff and breaking them. Whatever the reason may be, this eBay vault feature is going to be just a nice safety net for collectible sellers. Pretty much you're going to send your items into there. They're going to store it. Once it actually sells, the buyer will have a option of storing it there or getting it shipped to them. So you can sell something to someone else and it will transfer hands, but it won't ever move. So maybe you're a reseller or maybe you're a collector that doesn't actually need to like hold the item that you're collecting for whatever reason. Maybe you're just buying something to wait for the value to go up and then you plan on selling it again. This is a perfect way to do it because you can buy something from someone for cheap, store it in the eBay vault and then sell it without ever actually touching the item, which is pretty cool. So eBay will just send it to the buyer once you sell it. Now, I'm not a collectible seller. I don't deal with that kind of stuff. It's not my niche, but I know many of you guys are, and I think this will be a huge benefit to that whole community. I think it'll give people a little bit more reassurance. I think shipping will be faster, storage will be safer. So I think that this is a really big step towards the Amazon FBA model. Now, I don't ever see eBay being like fully Amazon FBA where you're just sending all your used junk in there and they're fulfilling it but I do think they're gonna adapt that concept in some sort of way. I think this is the testing phase. I think that eventually it will expand into more categories. Maybe they won't let you store all your used junk, but maybe they will let you do like an FBA model with new items that have barcodes and SKUs. There's no reason that eBay wouldn't really go down this route. They can create the infrastructure if they wanted to. They can compete with Amazon if they wanted to in this category, but it is gonna take years. This is not gonna be something that's overnight. I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of little issues and quirks with it like there always is with any sort of updates, but I think that this is a really cool step in the right direction. eBay is making a lot of changes and that's why I don't like when people talk crap about it. Like you have these old time sellers that are like, oh, 20 years ago, eBay was so great. No, it really wasn't. Like just because you can send a money order in the mail doesn't mean it's great. eBay is awesome right now. They're making changes for the future. They're adapting with the current times. So like this eBay vault thing is almost like a NFT thing, right? So you're buying something, but you don't necessarily have it tangibly in your hands unless you want to. And then you can just resell it for more money, which again is really cool. It's really kind of like futuristic as much as I hate to say that term, but it is. So I'm excited to see what happens with this. I'm excited to see what happens in the future with this whole program. And hopefully this benefits some of you guys and you make more money and your life is a little bit easier. And hey, if you missed the other eBay updates that came out a few weeks ago, make sure to check this video out here. I kind of cover a few of my favorite ones. And if this video is helpful, smash that like button for me and consider subscribing for more reselling help. And until next time, cheers.